a break, you know, in jazz. And, uh, and saying to myself, now how should I attack this practical problem of becoming a, uh, a jazz musician as a, a making a living and so on. And, and I said, well, ultimately I came to the conclusion that all I must do is take care of the music, even if I do it in a closet. And if I really do that, somebody's going to come and open the door of the closet and say, hey, we're looking for you, you know? Yeah. And this is the way I really uh, approached the whole thing. Really, I, I felt that otherwise, see, if, you, if I spread myself all over the place, I would have lost sight of everything. It's like you say, uh, isn't it terrible that there's a war here and uh, yeah. starvation there and poverty here? Now, what am I going to do as a human being about this whole thing, you know? Yeah. Well, gosh, if you try to accept every problem, you're just going to go insane. Yeah. So you have to choose some field in which you uh, operate at your best capacity and which will then serve as an influence yeah. to uh, deter all these other things that, you know, that you're worrying about. So I figure, like, if I take care of the music as best I can with my truest belief, right. then all these other things will be affected as I desire them to be affected as much as I can.